camo. This looks like it has more in it than the other cans. Check and see if you have any coupons for it. I don't know, Louie. Here, you look for it. So, when am I going to meet this Mr. Swab? I don't see any coupons for it. Louie, don't play like you don't hear me. Mr. Swab, when is he going to bless me with his presence? Now, you know mama got approval of anybody that's laying up with my baby boy. Oh, ma, you're so crazy. I mean, I don't know. Maybe I'll bring him over for Halloween this year. We, we could pass out candy to the little kids and trick-or-treaters and watch a horror movie marathon together. Oh, no. Uh-uh. Not this year. Not after Miss Dermer's grandson got mugged and beaten. Mm-mm. I don't want those vile kids at my door. You can't let one bad apple spoil the whole bunch, ma. Well, that's the world we live in. I'd rather be safe than sorry. Man, look at this faggot ass nigga. Yeah. Look at this nigga. In the store with his mom. Old puss ass nigga. I just don't understand why it's to be so damn aggravating all the time. Home. If you never have one, where do you go to find salvation and security? Everywhere else. And everywhere else ain't too kind. Yeah, Ma. Louie, what are the outside plant? When is she going to meet me? Watch this. You wish, asshole. What you say, nigga? What you say? I can smell the bitch in you, boy. You're so pathetic. Hey, bro. Hey, let's go, man. Twelve around the block. I can smell pussy on a bitch when I see one. You know what? You're not my type, but if I want it filled, I know where to come find it. What the fuck you say? Get we the can fuck take off care me. of that. Yeah, we got something for that ass, bitch. Hey, I need to leave the pretty lady alone. All right, faggot. We'll be back. Yeah, let's go. Hey, Ma. Louis, have you talked to Chrissy? No, I have not. Have you called her? I mean, to be honest with you, I really just haven't had the time. Well, when you do, next time, tell her when she come down here to bring me some of those chocolates she get from that fancy hotel where she works. So, where is this Mr. Swab? 
When is he going to come by and say hello to the madam? <laughs> no, he's so crazy. I mean, <laughs> Mr. Suave, Mr. Suave is temporary. Am I, Louis? I mean, it's just not realistic to, to expect someone to come in and change your whole life and sweep you off your feet. It's just not the world we live in, Ma. Like, Oh, baby. <laughs> There's someone out there that's just perfect for you. Don't worry. May love in the zoo. Fight with a lion or two. Can a player make you sweat till you got loose screws? From the bed in your room, call it bedroom boom. The melody saint and the snare saint. Now all the ladies clap. What is this shit? shit but that Look at this nigga. Faggot ass. Two step fuck is she wearing? What the fuck is she going to skin tight? From the fuck, bro. All the graph up on the titty so she never miss me. Pass the penny, pick and squish it when I lit the kitty. Pretty Ricky, father forgive me. Then I not mention the safe sex. The no Where the fuck? Oh, brother, blowing back, reminiscing about my stroke in. The U.S. so thin. Man, I'm tripping how she eagles so focused. Smiles from the master, but I'm classic like my old beans. I like them classic, like them classic, like my old beans. I like them classic, like them classic, like my old beans. I like them classic, like them classic, like my old beans. I like them classic, like them classic, like my old beans. Um. Are you going to perform today like I know you can and not be off in fantasy land again? Well, I'm here now, so I guess we'll see. Why do I try to rationalize every little thing from the top of your brain? You don't even make sense to me. Everything you do contradicts what you say. I won't even try, I blast your reply back to your own ignorance. Oh, oh, oh. Are you coming to Kalina's birthday tonight? I don't know. Where y'all going? Well, we're meeting at Mills for a little pregame turn up, and then we're all gonna meet at Kelly's around nine. You should come. I don't know. I mean, I can't make any promises, but it's definitely more definitely more of a yes than a no. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. All See, right. Come on, are you even serious right now? Like, this is getting ridiculous. And why is Christy calling my phone to check on you? Man, look, we are gonna go in the house, make sure it's empty, and if you see anything that look like money, Grab that shit. Man, what I'm trying to figure out is, how we gonna know if ain't nobody at the house anyway? See, Darius, you worry too much. Tommy gonna be the lookout. And as soon as we get the clear, we gonna run in that bitch and start packing. Darius, chill, bro. I'm gonna go around the back, and I'm jumping out the windows. Man, I'm just saying. Sound good, but y'all remember what happened last time, and how we know if his mom ain't up in there? We just can't run up in that bitch. Come on, tripping. Tripping? I'm tripping. Y'all niggas tripping, man. We gotta think this shit through. Man, the longer you think shit through, that just leave more room for you to fuck up. Man, if 
anybody and send that bitch when we get there. It's just a knock. Especially if it's that faggot ass nigga. See, cause a man like that, he got no balls. He gets no respect. You say you want your respect, right? So why are you asking me all them questions? All I'm saying is, it ain't even nothing like that. This shit is irrational though. Man, fuck irrational. You run around all day long talking about this your street and this your block. Now it's time to prove it. You want folks to take us serious, don't you? Yeah. So why are you scared? Oh, you scared to go back to jail. Don't do that. Don't even go there. Okay, okay. You scared to go back to jail. See, real niggas move in silence. They believe in themselves and they believe they are somebody. They got pride, they got respect. They go where they want, they do what they want and they take what they want. Feel guilty about it. It's not your fault. This is life at this moment in time. You know, it's crazy. It's kind of ironic, but it seems like you Sir. always have the right thing to say. Sir. Look. What's the name and date of birth? Um, January sixteenth, nineteen fifty-one. Renita Kenner. Are you okay, sir? Yeah. I almost, I almost lost you there. Thanks, baby. No problem, Mike. <laughs> so, tonight, Stormy and a few of the dancers were going to go to Kelly's to celebrate Course. Colleen is perfect. Well, I don't know. You asked me. Well, you need to go. Yeah. Get out the house, baby. Uh, go enjoy yourself. <laughs> I'll be fine. Yeah. Yeah. Try that. Try doing that. And tell Stormy not to be a stranger. Uh, it's been a while.
you been? You've been blowing me off? <sighs> Don't start with me, Chrissy. You know things have been going crazy. You know mom hasn't been doing well. And dance. You know what? You don't know because you haven't been around. So, whatever. What do you want? Like, and I'm not blowing you yes, off. Yes, you are. You are. Louie. Louie, talk to me, baby. I'm here. Mama told me about Joey and Darius harassing you. There's something else you should know. Thinking about the things you said to me In my mind I always knew we could never be I just need to get a couple of things This won't take long Could have got this stuff on the way home You all right, Mama? Just, just a little dizzy, baby. I'll, I'll be all right. Ma, I can go to the store to get what you need. Okay. Thank you, baby. Here, let me get you some money. Grab a box of tea and a bottle of aspirin. What you say to me, fuck boy? I said, what the fuck are you doing at my house? 
And I said, fuck you say to me. Fuck you, Joey. <laughs> Bitch. You have nothing to feel guilty about. It's not your fault. It's just life at this moment in time.